humans, I'm Yo Schiller, and welcome back to some more Animal Crossing New Horizons. Before I begin today's gameplay video, I need to explain something real quickly. For those that don't know, over the course of the month of February, I have been primarily playing the game in Japanese. I'm trying to understand the Japanese language, I'm trying to get better at reading and speaking it, and I thought since I play Animal Crossing New Horizons every single day, playing the game in Japanese would be beneficial to me, and it would allow for a nice change of pace in these daily gameplay videos. But now that the month is over, I figure it is time for me to switch the game back into English. It was a nice little experiment. I don't feel like I'm a master of Japanese, but I don't think just playing Animal Crossing for a couple of days in the shortest month of the year was going to help me perfect the language. But it was, it was fun to try out. It made things inconvenient and it caused some damage to my island, but we're going to really see what happened after I changed the game back into English, huh? Also, real quickly, when I... Switch the game into another language, my Nintendo Switch needs to reset itself, that's what this message is going to be right here, so I have to make a cut here, I will be back in just a moment, whoosh, and there we are, my Nintendo Switch is now in English, I had to do that before I booted up the game, I figured I may as well showcase it, because the rest of the series going forward will be in my native language of English, so let's continue on, and also the big thing for today, because it is now March 1st, you guys can probably tell from the title, the thumbnail, the description, social media in general, Mario 35th Anniversary items are now available in Animal Crossing New Horizons, and that is hype, and I'm going to focus on that today. Oh yeah, when you switch languages in this game, it changes how certain things are presented, which is kind of cool. It was all the more reason to try playing this game in another language. We got to see some things change. That's all okay with me. Awesome, it's, now, it's all gonna go back. So over the course of these past videos, I have been trying to focus on catching 50 fish, 40 bugs, and 20 deep sea creatures. And that's still important for me to do, but I'm not going to worry so much about that today. Today, I'm going to play with some of these Mario items, and I might do the same thing tomorrow, and then we'll go back to the quotas. I figured this is, again, a nice change of pace. I'm switching the game back into English. It's already a sidestep for today's video that already kind of distracts me, and then now the Mario items are coming here, too. I may as well just be consumed by the distractions. Let's not focus on quotas today. Let's... Focus on Mario stuff. Here we are. Oh, I'm looking forward to speaking to everyone about Mario stuff again. And I'm looking forward to doing so in a language that I can properly understand and speak fluently. Ah, uh, yeah. All right. But I'll catch a couple of fish, a couple of bugs, and a couple of deep sea creatures so I don't fall too far behind. Probably only five or ten of each. Hmm. That's the deep sea creatures that are going to slow me down. But we'll try ten of each. And then I'm just going to enjoy doing some work around my island. Isabel, hello, I can understand you again. Hello there, everyone. Right now in Auckland, it's 4.38 p.m. on Monday, March 1st, 2021. Hmm, there really isn't any news to speak of today. Oh, did anyone else catch that quiz show? Oh, well, okay. Anyway, it's time, Isabel. It's time to get those lovely Mario items. I'm a little surprised you didn't talk about that in your morning announcements, but that's okay. You don't always talk about the items that get added to the Nook Shopping catalog. That's not always news, I understand. Oh, it looks so nice. Oh, and then Timmy and Tommy are going to call me because I put some items into their drop-off box. And Oh, I can read the text again. And because it's a new month, I should probably update the design of my house as well. And probably something more orange. Is this how the game originally appeared when I first got it? The grass was this tint? Exciting. How very exciting indeed. Well, I've got mail. Is it going to be in Japanese or in English? Oh, I got a lot of stuff. Well, first we got Bank of Nook because it's a new month, so 6,652 bells were added to my bank account. Throw that away so as to save space. Then Wendy sent me something. It's in English! It's always fun to chat with you. You made me so happy and I thought I'd tell you so. In fact, spoiler alert, a lot of folks like you and care about you and wish they could buy an action figure of you. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Like a cheap candle, the snow is melting fast, replaced by lovely flowers and plants. Spring sure knows how to make an entrance. Two can play the melting game. Don't you get me a candle? Oh, my pockets are too full. Oh, I got I got too much stuff, guys. All right, one moment, please. We're going to make a quick detour to the shop. Oh, and because it's March, bugs are going to be everywhere. And different deep sea creatures, bugs, and fish will all be available. Oh, very good. Very, very good. All right, well, there, we're just off to a great start. My first bug in the month of March. Oh, and this is all decked out differently. It's all filled with green stuff. No more of that white winter snow stuff. It was nice and all, but I'm actually quite glad to see color again. This game really makes you appreciate the seasons while you have them, huh? 
All right, what do we got here? What the heck is this? Oh, it's a chemistry set. All right. Okay, I want to sell, and I am offering all this stuff that I obtained back when I was playing the game in Japanese, except for the pearl and the Nook Miles ticket. I would like to hang on to those. Oh, it's such a relief to be able to understand stuff again. Now, there are going to be some interesting things. Some of my villagers will probably still refer to me with a Japanese nickname of Oni. And one or two other villagers might have catchphrases that I wrote in Japanese. Like, Bengal will probably start saying, Subarashi now! Oh, there's a nice big butterfly. Well, for the sake of things, let me write down some numbers. In the off chance that I decide to pursue some quotas today, what are the numbers I would reasonably need to hit? If I was only getting 10 of each from this point onward. So if I were to only get 10 fish today, I should probably try to get 25. But if I were to only get 10, that would put me at 3, 6, 8, 5 fish. All right. And if I were to catch an additional 10 bugs, that would, oh, well, that would put me at 4020, which is perfect. 4020. And then if I were to only get 10 deep sea creatures, whoopsies, deep dive. That would put me at one, oh, 1666. All right. Hi. So that's what we'll do. We'll get 10 of each, but that'll be later on in the video. For now, I have some other things to tend to. I might even do one or two quick Nook Miles achievements just to get some extra Nook Miles before I go and use the machine. So let's go ahead and take care of a few things. Let's do this. And then we'll do. Oh, no, 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 Asking you sometimes shall receive. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. All right, let's commemorate the occasion. The time I got a gold nugget from this rock. There we go. In the month of March. I'm going to take plenty of other pictures later on, but for now. Hype. Got that. There, I took a picture. Now I got even more Nook Miles. Great, let's just let's just nab a few of those, huh? Oh, and sell weed clumps. That's always an interesting Nook Miles achievement to have available to me. But I'm not going to be focusing on these today. At least they're not going to be primary focuses. I will instead be focusing on Mario stuff. So, let me put on some appropriate Mario attire for the time being. Let me take off the wetsuit. Let me... Hey, remove the wetsuit. And then I'm going to go ahead and access my wardrobe. And I'm going to put on some clothing for now that isn't from the Mario 35th anniversary stuff that's going to be available today. We'll look at that catalog in just a moment. I want to just put on something Mario related because it's going to take a day for the Mario 35th anniversary items to arrive on my island. So, with regards to a shirt, I have custom stuff. Hmm. Oh yeah, I've got my Yoshi shirt. I made this. I made this. And then the hat. The hat, we gotta do the Yoshi hat. Alright, that'll do. What I got. And then I gotta finish checking my mail. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. So what else did I get? So, I got this. It's a real nice letter, but I'm going to throw it away so as to save space. And then, Toon Zelda. Yoshi's Egg Rug! What the heck? Well, thank you, Toon Zelda. I got to throw away the letter so as to save space, but I appreciate the gift. Give this to someone who wants this or not. Consider this as a hand-me-down. Oh, dearie. Thank you. All right, let me open these first, and then I'll open the letters that Charles sent to me. So, this one is going to be a candle or something, right? Mom's candle set. Hype. And then there's this one, which is Yoshi's egg rug. And then what's the hand-me-down item? Flowing river flooring, huh? Okay. Well, let's have a look. We got to put the egg rug somewhere. Maybe it won't fit in my living room, because my living room kind of has this aquatic aesthetic going on. But one can see, what does the Yoshi egg... Well, first, what does this look like? Oh, that looks nice, and I think I've had this before. But it's not going to stay in here. Mermaid flooring it shall be. This will go in storage. And then... I guess I got to put that in storage. But the Yo... Oh, oh, well, not what I wanted to do. That's not putting it in storage. It looks nice, though. No, no. We need to... We need to take this... Put it in storage. Now, the Yoshi's Egg Rug. No room here. Let's try the kitchen. It's been a while since I've done anything in my kitchen. A Yoshi's Egg Rug could be appropriate here. Maybe over by the cooking area. 
Although you don't really want to have a rug right where you're cooking, right? Because you're going to drop food all the time. So maybe underneath the dining room table? Let me see. Hey, that's pretty good. That's a good looking egg. That's a good egg. I like this egg. Let me do my feeling it reaction. Well, Toon Zelda, thank you very much. That's a that's a good looking rug. I like it a lot. Hmm. Do I want it more? Okay, I I I kind of want to play with this for a moment. I am glad that there is a Yoshi's egg rug. Okay, maybe like that. I don't know. Do I even want a rug in here now? That's the question. I guess if like someone has an animal or something, they can lean, they can hang out over there. I don't know. I like this rug. It's a high quality rug. I just don't know where I, where in my house I want it. I could put it in my room, but my room kind of has that cloud aesthetic. I okay. I got a better idea. <gasps> I put it in storage. That was an accident. Okay. Well, if I'm gonna be putting stuff in storage anyway, that goes in storage. That goes in storage. And while we're at it, because I've been playing the game in Japanese. What other random items have I been putting into storage without knowing, knowing because I can't read it? That's going to move back to my pockets. We got some bugs, sure. We got boots and we got this toad parasol. I could be using that today. Toad parasol. I feel like I should. All right, and then we got this Hinan, Hin, Hinan Gil. I think Toon Zelda sent me that. That was nice of her. Oh, wait! Mushroom mural? How did I get this already? When did I get that? What the heck? Alright, and then I got a Pisces fragment and and, and DAL umbrella and a cute DIY table and a pill bug, I guess. All cool things. Okay. So nothing, nothing really for the, the, this part of the house. Unless I can put like a music player up there, but no, no, no. We're good. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna carry this around. That's not what I wanted to do. I want. I, okay, we'll carry that outside. Let me go to my office. See if the Yoshi egg rug can go in there. Maybe right underneath my work desk. That would make the most sense, right? This entire video is gonna revolve around this, these Yoshi egg rugs. <laughs> not even. It's gonna revolve around something else, and you'll see in a moment. All right. So I've already got a rug in here. It's a. It's a nice rug. It's a nice rug. But here. Okay. Well, first. Yeah, first the rug, and then we're gonna see what this mural is. Whoa, I can't set it here. Why not? That now we're talking. Now it's now it's looking fantastic. All right, here we go. It's a little bright, but oh, oh yeah, okay. It's fine that I rotated that. I can just fix that. Here we go. If I move, and then I yeah, it kind of goes there. You can see the egg. I think that works. I think this makes more sense because that's my workstation. There we go. I got my egg. All right. Now we do this, and then we do boom, and then we're gonna make it look like I'm feeling it. I gotta really make sure I highlight that rug in all of its glory. There it is. All right. Now the the Mario mural. Which wall would that go on? I guess it has to go on this one. All right. It's time to clean up this wall. This was a long time coming. So we switch that. Raise, okay, so that needs to be lower to the ground. That makes sense being there. This photo was given to me. I did, I did not really want it to go there. I kind of want it to go here. That's just like an extra photo that I have. If I could like slide this over one, I can, uh, I cannot. Yeah, so that has to go in the center. All right, so this then, because you're not a villager on my island, you can kind of chill out there, and then okay. So we gotta we gotta move some stuff around. So the poster, the poster I, I I guess I like uh, that can go over there, and then I don't know how much space I'm gonna need for this. I guess we'll find out in a moment, huh? And then the clock can go there. All right, I'm gonna move more stuff around in a moment. We need to put up this Mario mural, mushroom mural. Whoa! It's it's just full on wallpaper. Oh! Oh, oh, doy! I thought it was just a, a like a picture. 
Now we're talking. All right, here. Let's let's get let's get that more. There we go. We got plenty of good pictures now. This is actually really cool. I don't think I'm gonna keep it. I like the the office aesthetic that I had already. I I do kind of wish I had a room where I could put it. Hmm. For the time being, I do not. At the very least, it gave me an excuse to put or to organize the stuff in my house a little bit more. All right. This is all very nice. You guys are all so generous for giving all these items to me. Okay. I've still got more mail, though. That's what I must use. Let's get that mail! And let's play with Mario stuff, baby! Here we go. Alright. So Charles sent me two items. He sent me Warp Pipe Bucko! There's no comma there, so he sent me a Warp Pipe Bucko. And this one. Oh god, Ipip Fra! Hang on one sec, there's a butterfly there. Priorities, man. Alright. Hey! Oh, I'm loving how more frequently the bugs are already spawning. Great. Alright, now then, I'm gonna take that. Ipap. Uh. Oh god, Ipip Fra! I'm gonna take that, and then I gotta throw your letter away so as to save space, but I appreciate it. Alrighty. We're all set. We're good to go. I'm ready for this. Alright, and there's wharf roaches. Don't mind if I do catch one extra bug. I was afraid I missed it there for a moment. Okay, so the warp pipes. I mean, this is this is the most anticipated part of this whole of this whole Mario 35th anniversary stuff. That's a pipe, and that's a pipe. They work as follows. You set one pipe in one location, one pipe in a different location. You go inside one, and you show up on the other one. Pretty cool. You can set these wherever you want on your island. So in theory, you could use these to create remote points of your island that are only accessible by warp pipe. And I have a couple of ideas that I would like to try out, which means today is going to be a terraforming day, the first time in a long while. But first, I figure it's only appropriate that I send something to Charles in exchange for these pipes. And I, I should probably send something to Zelda, Toon Zelda as well. She sent me some very cool items. That Yoshi rug, I love it. The flooring's cool too, I just already have a theme for my house. Alright, so I'm gonna use this machine. Hype. Then, I gotta go to Nook Shopping. And I gotta go to Special Goods. Then we gotta go to Promotional. So we want this for myself. 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 We want one of those. Yep, we, we want... Oh, no! Well, I can order stuff for other people. Let's see. There's a, there's a lot of cool stuff in here. Aha, mushroom mural and, and block flooring. That's it. That's all the Yoshi stuff we get is this rug. Hype. All right, now Charles... He might have specified what he wanted. I think he wanted the floating block. So I'll send that to him. Charles! Thank you. There you go. Okay, okay. So I'll send him that. And then I will send him coinage. And then I'll just have to order more Mario stuff over the course of the next few days. Alright. And then... I guess a coin. Send as a gift. Charles! There you go. And then this one. There you go. There's that. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Alright, we'll have more Mario fun over the course of these next few days. The fun don't stop just yet! And just to be on the safe side, in case I ordered him stuff you didn't really want, we'll send them. We'll send a regular block to Emma, because I know he can chat with Emma when the time comes. There you go. There's that. There's that. Cool. 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 Alrighty. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Alright. Yeah, he and Emma can work this out. Alright, and then the, 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 the fire flower, wait, that, no, yeah, fire flower will send also to Emma. 
There you go. All right, so boom, 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 boom. All right, so I can't really look like a Mario character just yet, but at least I can play with these pipes. So here's what I'm thinking. My island is mostly one big lake. So I might move some stuff around in my lake to make things look more fancy. More specifically, over on the eastern side of my island, I have what are what's basically a trophy garden. I have a I have a section for bugs and I have a section for fish. And I kind of want to move that over toward the lake of my island. So let's take a quick examination. If I head up here and I take a quick look at my lake, it's a nice looking lake, especially with the sunset lighting. But I always felt like something should be going right there. And I think that's where I'm going to put the trophy garden. Alright, because there's a satellite over here. And everything else, I mean, should probably be relatively open-ended. I say open-ended, but everything's kind of blocked off by proxy, but you know what I'm trying to say. Everything, it should still look like a lake. I shouldn't put too much stuff in the water. So... I might just have to, or I could do something over here. This kind of isn't doing anything. I already have a bridge over here, so I, may, I guess I may as well leave this be. But I could turn this into my bug trophy garden if I wanted to. Put the fish trophy garden over here, up, up there, up, up there. And then where the actual gardens are, I could put something else in their spot instead. That's what I'm thinking. Also, hang on, who's that up there? It's Flick! Oh, Flick, I'm so happy to see you. Hang on just a moment. I've been catching bugs. I need you to make another bug trophy for me. Let me stop by my house and withdraw some of the bugs I've been hoarding. And then tomorrow I will get another bug trophy from you. And I will add that to the new trophy garden that I am about to make. And I think this will all be oh so glorious. So... We gotta go to this, and then we gotta go to the creatures. All right, sort by type. Yeah, so this way they'll all be together. So we need, we need bugs. Yeah. So I've been catching plenty of mole crickets. Did I ever get a figure of mole crickets from him? This can't be all my bugs, really. That's all my bugs, huh? Maybe I already did this. Oh well, there's always the snail. Huh? Hang on, moth, moth, moth. Atlas Moth, and we did those. Bell Cricket, Red Dragonfly, Darner Dragonfly, Bagworm, Ants. Alright, I mean, we can always do Ants. Ants! I thought I had Mole Crickets, unless I did that already. Alright, then Ants, it shall be. Here we go, then. Ants. Yeah, that's it. Centipede, pill bug, snizzes, okay. I got nothing else. Very cool. Alrighty. Here I come. I'm gonna go and I'm gonna get that bug model. And then he can have the other bugs that have been catching the butterflies and whatnot. Speaking of, let's get one more for Flicky Boy, huh? Hey! Come here, butterfly. Thank you. Thank you for making this easier for me. Oh, I also realized while I was inside resident services, I should have changed the design of my house. Okay, let me do that. Let's, we're doing a lot of things today. Excuse me. Alright, so go inside here. Then I need to speak to well no, I gotta I gotta stop by my, my bank account. I don't remember how much it costs. Oh no, it's free. It's free, it just takes a day. Right? Alright, so let's do this. Hello! Hello! Nooketh the 35th. It is time to change my house. So about my home. Alright. And then we want to customize it. Okay. Yes, I'm ready. So we want to match this kind of oranges color that's going on. So here we go. We're going to do orange roof with the orange house. Maybe like yellow. Maybe yellow is a little better. And then the door. Yeah, we got to we gotta do either a yellow door or an orange door. Orange probably looks a little better because it goes nicer with the roof. Okay. And then the mailbox. Oh, the mailbox. Well, we could do a yellow mailbox. Because I don't think there's an orange one. Alright, that looks pretty good to me. Just to be sure. Is there like a softer orange? That's softer. And then the door. 
yeah, I think I like that a little more. Which means the actual... Oh, that, that, those are my options, huh? Is there a softer yellow? I mean, that's, that's cream. No, that's that's too much. That's too much. I mean, I could, I could do that. That's... Okay, you know what? I'm liking that. I'm liking orange and orange and orange and orange and orange. So we'll do that. This might be the second to last time I upgrade the design of my house. I'll probably do it one more time. But then the series will come to a close. I try to only do this, you know, at the beginning of each month. And that's only become a more recent thing. But there we are. My house will look like that tomorrow. Alright, so that's done. We're all set on that front. Now, I need to talk to Flick. Or I need to see if there's ants. Let's get an ant, huh? Are there any extra ants? There are not, and you know, that's okay. That is okay. So, Flick, I must have a word with you, if that is okay. Are you still up here? You are! What's up, my good man? Oh, hey, remember me? I do, but last time I spoke to you, it was all in Japanese. Okay, well, I'm ready to commission you, even though it's free for me, I guess, but I'm, I'm willing to give you these ants so I can get an ant model. All right, so, ants! All righty, great. Yes, please. You can have those. I hear that mole cricket. It is very loud. All right. All set. Great. Thank you, sir. And I guess real quickly, I'll grab this. And let's catch the five wasps that are guaranteed to spawn on my island. So there's one. And then I'll sell him to Flick because he's here today. All right. So there's one. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. And then if I go up here. This will be... Two. Excellent. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, I'm loving all these easy to catch bugs. So two. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take this. All right. And then there's bug number three. Very good. Very good, very good, very good. And then we need to shake this tree. Yep, and that's gonna be number four. Excellent. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And then, ba -ba 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 -ba. hey, I'm gonna take this. Also, I haven't spoken to you in English. You moved into my island only because I selected an option in Japanese by mistake. What is your actual English name? Oh, good. Everything bad happens around you. Now my net's broken. Kurlos. Well, if it isn't Yo Schiller, it's been a while since we crossed paths. I was starting to wonder if you were under some kind of non disclosure agreement, like about your life. No, I just don't really. I haven't really warmed up to you. I don't know if I will before this series comes to a close, if I'm being completely honest. Alright. Oh, by the way, this is my trophy garden. This is where I have the bugs. This is where I keep the fish. Look, this is a nice looking trophy garden. I like how it turned out. But I think I want to recreate this over on the left... Or over on the left side of my lake of my island. So let's get a couple pictures before I completely destroy the place. Alright, can I... Yeah, there we go. There. And I blinked. Perfect. Yeah, you can't even properly see all the models here. That's okay. We'll play with this. And then I might move the bug... the bug trophy place here, too. And I might put a new staircase somewhere else in case I ever need to access stuff. But for now, I have to get one more wasp. I freaking swear, oh hang on, I have, to, I have to get another net. I freaking swear if it's in that tree that, that Kurlos is sitting in front of, that's it, we're through. I'm, I'm not, I'm never giving him another chance. Alright, so let's craft, and then we do flimsy net, and then we'll upgrade that to a regular net, and that'll be oh so nice. Alright, so keep crafting, ba -ba -ba -ba. and then we do that, cool, excellent, 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 thank you, all set. Alright, so now we go over here. Now we take this tree branch. Alright, watch out, dude. I'm gonna shake this tree and wasps might come out of it. Oh, there's a butterfly first. Hang on. Priorities, man. Thank you. Didn't even applaud me. Not that you had to, but you're not really, not really warming up to you. Oh, there's money. Okay, which means the tree that has wasps in it, or the fifth tree that have wasps in it, is probably this one. So let me see. Nope, that's furniture. Formal paper, okay? Hey, I can actually read what items I'm getting now. Hype. Alright, so hang on. Did I shake this tree? I did. Well, I didn't. Rat and waste bin. 
And which tree did I not shake? This one, all right. Wasp number five. Very good, easy peasy. All right. Hey Flick, I've got a bunch of bugs for you. I would like to sell them and obtain bells, please. Oh, wait, one more butterfly. Well, don't mind if I do. Come here. Oh, bug catching is gonna be so much better this month. Yeah, because outside of playing the game in a language I didn't understand, I was also playing during a time in the winter where bugs just refused to spawn. But now there's so many. Speaking of so many, that's a lot of weak clumps. Now I see that why wow, that's one of my daily Nook Miles achievements I have to clear. Or can clear. Alright, Flick. I'm here. Peacock Butterfly. Alright. Here we go. So I've got a bug to sell. I've got plenty of bugs to sell. Here you go. Boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. Alright, you can have all those. Very good. Alright, 21,000 bells. Yes, sir. Alrighty. All set. Very good. Nice. Alright, let's, let's get down to the nitty gritty. Let's start terraforming. Or, I guess I gotta sell a few extra things. The wasp nest and the waste bins. Make sure I don't sell the pipes, though. That would that would be bad. I mean, I can get more, but today is gonna kind of just revolve around them. And another butterfly? Alright, I'll catch that real quickly. Just because it's so easy! And it'll make future days easier! And tell you what, if I go down here right now, will there be ants? Will there be ants? <gasps> ants! I guess I can finally put all these rotten turnips away, too, huh? I guess I don't have to rely on ants anymore. Eh, I'll leave them for one more day. I'll put them away tomorrow. When things return back to me fulfilling quotas, I'll catch one more ant and be like, Alright, I don't need these turnips anymore. Because bugs are regularly spawning on my island again. Alright, now we're just going to use the drop-off box. Okay, so. Boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. Here we go now. I guess I should start by putting on my island designer cap, huh? You guys can't see it based on this perspective, but... I am going to change my headgear. There it is. Alrighty. So now if I run toward the back of my island, I can start doing a little bit of work. So... Oh, there's a balloon over there? Well, I'm probably not going to get it because it's just going to fall in the water, right? Oh, but if my trophy garden was here, it wouldn't be an issue. Well, we're not going to we're not going to get that right now. For now, we are we've got work to do. I got to remember how to terraform stuff. So, waterscaping, right? Cuz now we got to make some platforms. Okay. Boom. And then boom. And then boom. Here we go. Moving it to it. All right. So, how big do I want it to be? I guess it could start right around here. I might do something similar. I might have like mini waterfalls behind it or something. Yeah, so this is about as far wide as it can go. Okay. So how many spaces was this? This is one, two, three, four. Okay. So we need four more to the left. So I want to even out. Two, three, four. And then I can get that butterfly if I so desire. And I do desire. Got it. Extra bugs, baby. All right. Now, back to the task at hand. Boom. Alright. So now we go up. So one, two, three, four. Okay. And then let's see how far up I can go on this side. So this is one, two. I might not be able to do four. Uh, I guess I can do four. Yeah, that's just enough. Okay. There. I might, I might need to shrink this down by one on each side. Okay. Maybe I'll do that. Because now it's a little too close to the wall up there, and I don't like that. I don't want people to be able to hop over here. Cool. Okay. Uh, looks like I could try to scoot that in a little more. Hmm. Alright, I guess I'll leave it for now then. Let's fill this in. If I need to change things up a little later, then I will... Then I'll do so. I mean, I'm nearing the end of the series, so it's it's really make it or break it time. But let's get it. So we're doing this. Boom. 
fill all this in. Okay, boom. And then we do... Boop. We do... Ha! Okay. Uh, if I could, I'd probably... I, okay, I'd like to try and push these, like, one more back. But... Oh, it's probably not going to work out. Okay. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I got the... I have an idea. Okay. First, let me fill this in. My words are not going to make much sense because I'm trying to focus on creating the idea in my head and then bring it to fruition. Okay. So, what I want to do now is I want little waterfall cliffs to be along the back sides here. So we do... Yeah, put those right along the edges. Okay. Okay. I mean, that's, that's fine. So put this here. Okay. And then we do this. Boom. And then we do that. Yeah, just just along the edges, but not the front part, because this is this needs to be viewable from one side. Okay. And then we do this. It's going. Got it. Cool. And then we do hoppa. Nice. Cool. I have another idea. All right, hang with me here. You're you're in you're watching the de de developmental process of me coming up. That I can't even speak. You're watching me come up with ideas for my island. This will go in there, even if it's irrelevant to everything else around it. I just I just want it to go over here. Nice, pretty tower. All right, so hang tight. Let's go up here. And I I want it to go. I want it to go right there. Alright, so this, this pagoda, cannot put it there. Frick. Alright, well, we'll figure that out in a moment. For now, I, I do need to have extra cliffs right here anyway, because that's how I'm going to get the waterfalls to appear. So, up. Good. Good. Okay. Because in order for a waterfall to, to be available, there needs to be one space behind it where there could be a standing space. So we're going to make this work. Okay, and then what I'll need to do then, yeah, so these are all going to be waterfalls, okay, cool, 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 alright, now before I, oh hey, another balloon, my chance at redemption, or my shot at redemption, because I'm using a slingshot, alright, here we go, and poof, great, Take this. Thank you. Boom, boom. All right, a sewing machine. Don't quite need that right now. What I'm going to do before I put the waterfalls in is I'm going to go over to my current fish trophy garden and I'm basically just going to go and destroy it. Hey, another butterfly. Don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do get some more bugs. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. We're getting it. Just a couple more bugs to go. When I say a couple, I mean 900 more bugs to go, but we're getting there. We're getting there! Ah! Are there any ants on the way back? How about that? Are there ants? There are ants! Ants! All right, and then I'm gonna, you know, over the course of the next few days, I'm gonna clean up my island and make it look spick and span and presentable and get ready for me to leave it as the series comes to a close. But for now, there's still more terraforming work to be done. Let's head back here. All right, so this is a nice all garden and all. But I gotta destroy it. So in order for me to even access any point down here, I have to start closing up some of these. I have to, well, I have to close up all the waterfalls. So I guess we'll start with that. Close up the waterfalls. It's been nice looking. It's been cool. It's been featured in all sorts of my Animal Crossing videos. But now it is time to put it away. It is time to put something else here instead. What that will be, only time will tell. All right, here we go. Nice. And then, nice. And then, up All right, and then this waterfall. Coming along. Oh, it feels weird to destroy this, but I know it's for the better. It'll all look so cool when it's all done. All right, and then we need the south side waterfall. Okay. And then I'll have another day where I'll put something else here in its place. But for the time being, I'm just moving these these models these trophies around okay and then hop good 
and then good. All right, now I gotta go down there and collect everything. Okay. If, if it lets me, there we go. All right. So, boop, boop, boop. Okay, good. And then we do waterscaping permit. All right, let's grab all these, and then we'll fill all this in, and then I'll put all the cliffs back in, and it'll just look like nothing was ever here. It'll just be one big old blank space here. Isn't that weird to think about? Because that's what it's gonna be. All right, I'll take that. Thank you. I just wanna get all the trophies first. I should have enough inventory space for all of them. And then if I ever get more fish trophies, if I ever decide I want more, I might have more space for them going forward. We'll see. Okay, so we do this. Okay, and then we'll do that. Cover that up. Oh, it's gonna look so good, and then I'll have more reasons to invite friends over to my island because I'll have some sort of new development on it. In fact, I'll have reasons to go to all my other friends' islands too because they'll probably stick warp pipes on them. Although it's worth pointing out, you can only have the two warp pipes. You can't have more. I kind of wish you could have more, and then they'd be like color coded, let's say, but I get it. It's a lot to keep track of. Alright, oh, no, 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 not what I wanted. Alright. We're all set. Cool. Whew, yeah, this is definitely just some big ol' empty lot. Oh, my pockets are full, huh? Alright, well then, I will... Hmm, I, can, I guess I can let a bug go. Co, release it. Alright, for the time being, as a future note to myself, here's what I'm gonna do. I will leave one pipe just kinda here. So one pipe here. And then I want the other pipe to allow me to more easily access Red's shop. Oh, and I will I will catch these bugs. You better believe I will. There's one. Thank you. I said I would only catch 10 bugs today, but now I think I'm on, on, on pace to catch all 40 today. Maybe. All right, there's two. Awesome. All right, and then uh, let it go. Goodbye. All righty. Here we go. Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba. Yeah, so red shows up over here. This is not the most accessible place. I might finally install a staircase here or something. But for now, I will put the other warp pipe, if I can, right here. Perfect. Now next time red is here, I can warp to his island with ease. I don't need to use the ladder. That gives me some more inventory space. That's just kind of what I'm thinking for my island, and then fine, I'll pick up some of these weed clumps. I agree, this is getting out of control. Ugh. Here we go. Alright, and then boom, we got that. I'm heading back over to the right. Yeah, so in theory, I can just hop across here, right? Yeah, I can. For the time being, that's fine, but I don't want that to be a finalized thing. It cannot stay like that. Alright, now we need waterscaping permit. Can I, oh, I guess I can't do that one because it's a corner piece, but I can do this one, and then this one, and then, oh, come on now. Can't do that one. Okay, yeah, okay, I, I, just, I can't do that one, okay. Hop, and then hop. Very good. Very good. I guess this kind of works out because I need to get out of here, so fine, I'll hop off, but it can't stay like this. Oh, actually, I, I guess I gotta, I gotta leave some anyway. Okay, so, darn it. Okay, that's fine. So now we're gonna put the bug, we're gonna put the fish models in. So let's let's put some like here. So no goldfish model, sure. Okay, let's put this, let's put the shovel away for a moment, huh? Goldfish model, and then we need I don't know what else will fit here. Not the whale shark model. The oh, or fish model is kind of big. The catfish model, sure. There you go. Let's rotate them all around. Okay. And let's let's work in reverse here. So now, we got something over here. We need the. I think it's the football fish model could go here. All right. And then we go here, and we can put. Hmm. Point, yeah, the koi model. Ah, this, this should actually be reversed. I want people to prominently see the koi. The koi model. 
Here it is. So koi model goes there. Favorite kind of fish. Big old koi fish. There you go. Alright, and then we can do the... What I have here? I have the football fish model. Right, right, right. Okay. Boom. That goes here. There you go. And then the big fish, those are the ones that need to start going back over here. So we do this. And then we do... Yeah, okay, so whale shark. Yeah, that's a, that's a big one. Alright, so that goes in the corner. Can I hop over there? Fine. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta think about this a little more then. So... Oh, actually, can I put the other end of a waterfall here? No, I cannot, right? Yeah, okay, never mind. Got my hopes up. Doy, what was I thinking? Is that gonna work? Alright, so... We need... Salmon model, I guess, goes there. Spin this around. Okay. And then we need... Oh, you know what I should have done? Frick, this needs to be... I need to put textures on these. Okay, hang on. That's what I messed up. This area over here can no longer just be grass. This needs to be textures. So, what textures do I got? Hmm. I, I mean, I guess I can use the ones that were made for me. These regular old grayish ones. Okay. Then this it shall be. Alright. Let's, let's, let's color all these in. Alright, there it is. Okay. Up, uh, there we go. Glad I remembered, because otherwise I'd have to undo everything. There we go. And for decoration's sake, I have the one that has a has a frog on it. Frog. Frog. Alright, and then this. Oh, I see a balloon coming by. Alright, hang on a second. Hang on a second. I'm a little occupied. There you go. Vase. There you go. And then... Thank you, Joel the Parrot, for making these textures, by the way. Joel the Parrot was the one who made these textures. I did not make these. He did a fantastic job with them. Thank you very much, sir! Alright, there it is. Alright. Alright, this balloon, I see it. How do I get it? Right, hang on, hang on, hang on. It's a, lot of, it's a lot of stuff to keep track of. Come here. Alright, alright. Balloon, you're going to land right in the center of my new establishment. The soon-to-be fish trophy garden. <laughs> uh, wow, my slingshot broke. That's crazy. Okay, well, I'll take this. At least that allows me to have enough inventory space for it. What is this, though? Gas range. Don't need that. All right. Hang on. Let me back out of here. Okay. And then... Ba -ba 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 -ba. Let me sell one or two items, and then let me make a new slingshot before I forget. So, make sure I only sell the gas range and, like, one bug. I don't want to sell everything else by accident. So that, that, that. Okay, and then the, where's the gas range? Don't sell any of the models. Oh, what, well, yeah, that would, that would be the gas range right there. Okay. Good? Good. Okay. I brought that toad parasol out with me for nothing. I'll use it tomorrow. I will use it tomorrow. Okay, here we go. Trying to get as much stuff done as I can in the span of an hour. So let's craft. We gotta go over to tools. Slingshot, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. Good, good. New slingshot. We're all set for when future presents fly by. And I knocked out a Nook Miles achievement for crafting items. Okay, great. Thanks, extra Nook Miles. I'll take them. Catch bugs, I mean, I guess I can do that. I was supposed to catch 10 deep sea creatures. I guess I can end the video with that. For now, I need to get back up. Alright. I gotta finish texturizing this area. Okay, and now, I'm pressing plus. There we go. Boom. Boom. Alright. So we got this. Nice. 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 Okay. Here we are. Very good. Very good. Hop. There it is. There. So that's the top part. Now I'm going to drop down and do the bottom part, and then I will set more stuff down. So, this. 
custom design. That. Okay. There we go. So, hop. And then we do hop. Very nice, very nice, very nice. Yeah. Cool. Cool. And then I guess the, the little shrine thing I have, the Hagoda, that will go down here. Because shrines are usually by the water or like have a view of water, right? So it would make sense to have that item over here. I mean, I had it in front of a different waterfall, but I, I really, I really wanted to go somewhere over here. So let's see what I can do. So, up, oh, I do this, and I set the item like here. Let's see, so, P Pagoda, sorry. Can't set it there. Okay, let me, let me take a few steps back. Okay, da da da, ba ba ba. It looks good in my opinion. Darn it, is it always just gonna be like slightly off center? That's obnoxious. What if I set it down differently? What if I what if I like better get it? And I do this. Pagoda. Alright, now if I slide you over. It's a, uh, I think it's the same issue. Really? Can't you just like work with me here? Land on that exact space that I need you on? Oh man. Oh that's that's annoying. Alright, step back. I guess I just have to deal with it. I guess I could make this one space wider. No, I can't. I can make it one space thinner. I might have to. Just to get that to look good. Oh, okay. I do want that to look good. One space thinner it shall be. Which is I gotta destroy all these. Okay. So in order to destroy these, we gotta fill these in. Okay. And then this needs to close by one. Okay. Here we go. Climb it on down. That's fine. One space thinner. But then it's it's too close to this waterfall, but maybe that's not as big of a deal. Alright, so now we need cliff. De Cliff destruction! Oh! Tear it all down! Tear it down. Alright, there we go. Destroy it. Destroy it. Okay. And then, okay. And then, okay. And then, okay. And then there's you. Okay. And then now, just to double check. So now, this can be in the center, right? I mean, not really. It's never gonna line up. Well, no. If I put one more waterfall there, it'll, it'll look a little better. Okay. This is good. This is this will work. So we do this. All right. So water. Hey. Okay. And then that. And then that. That. Get that out of here. All right. Very good. And then one more cliff here. It's like a little bit of a puzzle, but I'm I'm getting it. And then we need one more. Here we go. Alrighty. It's a little more compact now, but this will work. Just one sp one little square makes all the difference, huh? That's okay. So we do this. We do. Hup. Alrighty. Oh, yeah. I wanted. Oh. Alright, I gotta climb back down. Hang on. It's a little more work than I thought, but we're gonna get it. I'm not gonna finish the whole thing today. I've kind of come to embrace that fact. Alright, so... No, we need... Cliff construction. Yeah, because I need, I need waterfalls on this side now. Okay, so that means, yeah. Then this... Boom. Boom. Okay. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. Figuring this out. Sorry, it's hard for me to commentate while I'm trying to troubleshoot here. We got it though. I've got, I've got this. And then we got to put a cliff here. Was is this even entertaining to you guys? I don't. I don't know. All right. This needs to go back. Okay. Push. We push this back. Okay. Now I climb back up. Frick, I just do all this for nothing? The pagoda's just not gonna work here, huh? Darn pagoda! I'm starting I'm starting to get afraid that yeah, this just won't work. 
I think I had it better before when it was one more space to the right. Ah! Uh, pagoda! I mean, I mean, let me try pulling it. I think it's just always going to be off-center. It, it just needs to be in the center relative to the waterfall in the back. Oh! Ah! Uh, no, it's never going to be. Frick. It's never going to be, huh? And what people don't know won't hurt them, right? Maybe, maybe let's continue on as planned. All right. So, now I need to get this back out. All right. It seems so much tinier now. It's just one square of it. It's just so tiny. Alright, and then we need a we need a pot right there. And then we need a frog. And that goes in the top right. There we go. And we said the uh, is that it? There's not a frog in the lower left, is there? Did I put a frog in the lower left? No, it's just open right there. Okay, good, good, good. Alright, so now we do this. Boom. Boom. Alrighty. There. There. Okay. It's coming together. Oh, I, uh. Yeah, see, now I think I like it more with, with it being one space wider. Alright, back to the original plan. I'm that guy. This is not center. If I'm, I may as well make it bigger. Alright. Frick. Go back up. Go back up. At least I can leave some of the textures in. Like, one or two spaces. Alright. We're making this one space wider, and the pagoda will figure out what to do with it a little later. Alright. And then I just need to destroy the bottom pieces this time. These little corner pieces. And then extra butterfly. Don't mind if I do. Alright, thank you. Come here. Very good. Okay. Alright. So, cliff construction. We gotta do this. Ugh. Okay. Alright. Changed my mind, darn it. Let's make it one space wider. I had it right before. It looked better that way. This is much too small now, and I want the things on my island to be grand! I'm gonna spend all this time putting them together. I want to make sure that I do them correctly. Okay. Now we need cliffs. So, cliff. Alright. Cliff. Cliff. And then cliff. Alright, yeah. This does look a bit better. Alright. Cool. And then destroy that. Destroy that. Hey. Destroy that one too. Alrighty. Now I can go up top. I can put those waterfalls back in. Alrighty. And then we gotta do this. Boom. We do. Up. There. And there. Okay. Wait, was that it? It was only two spaces? Oh, I guess it is only two spaces. Okay. Then we got the, the, the frogs gotta move. Alright, so we do custom design. Where's that frog? There's that frog. So we do boom. And then the pot is is oh, this is one space too wide. That's fine. I'll fix that in a moment. The pot goes there. Alrighty. Yeah, this... I, I can delete this cliff. So let me do that. And then I'll finish retexturing this again. Again. So cliff construction. That. Alright, let me put these textures back in. So now we do this. Aquanet base. Good. 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 Okie dokie. And now I go up here. Alright. We got it. It's coming together. Custom design that. So you must go. And then, yeah, just a couple more of these. Alright. Alright, I had it before, and then we'll drop a few fish models in here, and then we'll see how that all looks. Okay. <sighs> so, koi fish. I want to be prominently viewable. Catfish, goldfish. No, no, no. So, koi. Koi goes there. And in this game, I believe the counterpart to the koi was the catfish, right? 
Mm, where is it? Great white. No, 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 no. Football. No, no, no. Catfish. 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 There. I guess they should be facing toward each other. I get that the, that the little plate is on, you know, a specific side of it, but I, I like the idea of the ones on the right facing to the left and the ones on the left facing to the right. Okay. So now we can put a sturgeon model here. All right. Do, do. And then we go back over to the left, and we can put, ba -ba -ba -ba, I guess a king salmon model. Oh, that, is that too big? Or am I facing the wrong way? What happened? All right. No, no, no. We need king salmon. No, it's a normal size. Yeah, that works out. Sturgeons and king salmons. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Now we go back over here, and we put, hmm. Yeah, the oarfish model's kind of big. I guess just a goldfish. Can't put it there. All right, all right. We'll get it. Goldfish. Okay. Spin that around. Cool. And then we'll go over here. And we'll put... Da -da 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 -da. I guess just salmon. Can't put it there. I'm, I'm too close, I guess. Come on, salmon. There you go. Salmon. Cool. All right. Now we need to start getting some different ones in there. So football fish. Cool. I can go there. Hey, come on. Work with me here. Football fish. All right. And then we need to put the ray here. All right. And then we got to do boom and then boom. And then... Ba -ba 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 -ba. Now we can put some two space models here. So like a whale shark can go there. Yeah, there we go. And then here can be great white shark. Yeah. Oh, hang on. Let me, let me actually, I can't, I can't rotate it, huh? Uh-oh. That's not going to be good. Okay, what if I what if I do it this way? If I set it there. Ray model, no, not the showing, not the sewing machine. Great white shark model. It won't rotate at all. There we go. I can't rotate it at all, really. All right, then I gotta I gotta troubleshoot this. I will get this done today. Hang on. I need an evacuation platform. I need a way to get out of there that doesn't require me jumping across. All right, one moment, please. I gotta work my way around. <laughs> I'll get it. I'll get it. It's gonna be fine. Here we go. Make my way back over there. Hang on, are there ants along the way? Let's check. There. Are no ants waste of my time? All right, back over to the left. We're gonna we're gonna get this. It's gonna be oh so good. None of this stuff involves the warp pipe, but it it was the warp pipe that motivated me to do any of this today. I just want to say. All right, so back around. <laughs> I know, not super convenient. To just work with me here. Okay, so I need like a, a a roundabout path right around here. Okay, whatever. Eh. We're good. I just want to I want to get this done and then I'm gonna catch just a couple of fish a couple of deep-sea creatures And then we'll be done for the day if I even decide to do that. I don't know how much longer this is gonna take Hopefully not too much longer Okay, here we go And then that's there in the back and then I guess I can fill that in real quickly, too It's gonna be deleted later Okay, so now I need an extra clip here Oh, this is gonna get real messy, but we're gonna make this work. All right. Now I've got plenty of ways out of here, if need be. So in that case, I guess I should work my way from the left over to the right. I know the great white shark model is gonna go there. So that means this should be the ocean sunfish model, like here. Yeah, there we go. I need. I wanted that to be facing the opposite direction, though. Can I do that? Okay. Oh, I have an idea. All right, this, this is like a puzzle. Here, 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 here. So if I do this, and I go boom. No, wait, wait. 
Can you need ocean sunfish model. I need you to... Alright, different idea then. I have to face down because I want it to face to the right in the end. So, ocean sunfish. There it is. Alright, fine. Use the ladder to go down. Man, this is a puzzle. Okay, alright. Check this out though, guys. Check this out. Watch me be smart. Alright, and then we go up. And then we go... Oh! <laughs> All the way to the left. Get over there. Keep going. Oh, it's like I'm actually playing the Bomberman level that this island is based on. Although, this level doesn't have pushing puzzles. It's other parts of the game that do. Alright. Good. That frog is still viewable. Awesome. Alright. Now, we need the next one. Well, the ray model is going to go here. That much is decided. Alright. Spin around. Spin around. Okay, I don't have enough fish models to fill this area right now, but for the time being, I gotta put the great white shark. How many more do I have? I got, I, I only have, oh, I have ore fish. Oh, that's, that's perfect, actually. So great white shark. Right. Right. Okay. Great white shark, I wanted to be facing the opposite direction. That was the whole point of this. So let me go down here. Eh. Okay. We're gonna get it. I need to put in, like, one more cliff. Huh. Okay. Good. Go back up. Good. Good. Okay. Whew! It's a great white shark. Goes over here. No, no, no. Not, not there. What are you doing over there? Come here. Rotate it back. There. Now we can do this. Okay, go up one more. I slide through here, I can. Okay, good, good, good. It won't let me it won't let me push this. Oh my god. Hop across. Alright. Great white shark! Alright, fine. Put the ray model away for a second. Bring this down. Okay, it's ba this is basically where it's gonna go. I just I I need I needed you to be like one more space to the left. Can I do that? Can if I stand? And then now there's another balloon. I don't have time for that balloon right now. I gotta get this shark model to face just the right way. Can you please go like one to the left, please? Oh, you know what? That's that's better. Okay. So now we set we set the ray model back. Ray model. Boom. What do you mean there's no room? All right, fine. Pass up on the balloon. All right. Ray model. Good. Eh. Uh, eh. Uh. Durr. Durr. Wait, no, no, no. Because now I gotta, I gotta pull this down. Okay, so hop. Right there. That's where I want it, right? It lines up with the other one? Good. Ugh. <laughs> oh, but now I gotta put the ore fish model there. Okay, can I do that? If I face this way, will the ore fish model face the same way I want it to? Okay, alright, alright. That works. That works. Okay. Oh, good. And now that only leaves the ray model to go here. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. There. Now let's delete these cliffs. Alright, let's clean up the mess. And I'll, I'll do other stuff a different time. Oh, that's so much better. Alright, let's get a picture. Alright. Da, 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 da. That's not the Mario jingle, but it's what I'm deciding to hum today. All right, there it is. Open your eyes. Yes, thank you. All right, we'll find we'll find out what else to do with this area. But for the time being, let me delete the cliffs. I'm probably not going fishing or deep sea diving today, guys. So, in case. Wait, what? Oh, that's water keeping. I was, I was going to say, if I can't delete these cliff, cliffs, oh, it's game over for me. All right, well, I'll tell you what. Maybe I'll catch, like, one or two extra bugs. Let me destroy these cliffs. Make my way over to that one bug. Probably not going to get that butterfly, actually. I mean, I, I... No, I can't squeeze through there. All right, go bye, butterfly. And then... I guess I can smooth this out. 
There it is. Okay. Now I need waterscaping. Oh frick. I already, I already messed up. Alright, put that back. I need this to be gone. Alright. This. Thank you. Good. Huh, okay. That's much better. Get right, delete all of this. Alright. It's coming together though. My new fish trophy garden. And then we'll do the bug trophy garden a different day. Ugh. That'll do. That'll do. I guess... Hmm. I don't really need to delete the path over here. What I need to do... Ugh, I can delete it for now. That's all I'm going to do with it for now. Hup. And then... Hup. Okay. That. And... Oh, frick, not that one! Why did that happen? Alright. Now I gotta... I gotta get the brick texture back out. Okay, bricks. And then... Do I still have that fence piece or did I sell it? I do have it right here. Very good. Put that back. Alright! Yeah. Now I got more stuff here. It, it definitely needs a centerpiece. But I can, I can address that on a different day. For the time being, let me get an extra bug if I can reach that. As a matter of fact, how many bugs have I caught today? Because if I, was, if I were to only catch 10... Oh, well, I caught 20. Because catching 10 would have brought me to 4,020. This brought me to 4,030. So that's pretty good. I think I'll leave it at that then. Never mind. Butterfly, you get to be free today. And then we're not going to do deep sea diving or fishing today. We'll play with this more. And I'll get more Mario stuff to utilize tomorrow. And we'll move staircases around and all that. But for now, that wraps up today's video of Animal Crossing New Horizons, and I'd like to thank you all for watching. I hope to see you all in future videos when I continue the architecture of my island and I play with more Mario 35th Anniversary stuff. For now, bye bye humans! Whoosh! Hey! Thank you for watching my video! If you want to continue to support my content, the best thing you can do is like this video and subscribe to my channel! All you have to do is click the little buttons down below. Also, please be sure to follow me on Twitter to stay up to date with my video schedule. My tag is at RealYoShiller. I hope to see you all in future videos! Bye bye Whoosh!